What's up, everybody? Alex Adams here, back for more Batman. The Tall Tale Game. Mr. Wayne, thank you for opening your house to us. Together, we will change Gotham. The Harvey Dent, Gotham's next mayor, and eager to know you. Vicki Vale, not interested, and reporter for the Gotham Gazette. Carmine Falcone? Is the Dent campaign soliciting votes from Gotham's biggest crime family? <sighs> Your father knew which hands to shake. I already shook your hand, I just realized. Uh, I don't look down and be like, I already did shake your hand out there. It's dangerous. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so currently I'm not drinking pop, but. This is Selena. I have been, so... Is that the name of the actual Catwoman? Selena? How many? I assume it would be, I but... The they could easily change that if they wanted to. Calling card. Especially if there's been multiple Catwoman. The chemicals. Where are they? Well, we played there, couldn't you? I should have thrown his ass off the, off the building. The weights. Well, the weights are the biggest gangsters in Gotham. You know, I just realized he said the Waynes. I thought he said the Wings when I played this. It was hard because you, you got to pay attention because you don't know when a, a, an option is going to come up. So you got to pay attention to that. And it's hard to fucking pay attention to what people are saying. This game adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. That's generally how uh, Total does things. Now, anyway. Ever since The Walking Dead, this is all they've been doing. Well, as far as I know, this is mostly what they've been doing. And I think, I think most people would, consi uh, would uh, prefer this. I wouldn't mind if they had, uh, made an actual game game. Go to do this. you now, Master Bruce. So wait a minute. If they were, if they were, um, crime lords or whatever, then the person that killed them probably got screwed over by them or something. You should see this. Or was just. Saying, you know, I'm getting rid of you fuckers. Bruce. More allegations about his ties to the underworld. This isn't going away. It's all so public and messy. I can't you see this. You are throwing stones at my family, Alfred. I need to understand why. It's my family, too. Don't forget that. Yes, but it's literally my family, Alfred. I've been dreading this day for nearly two decades. I... I hoped it would never come. Forget the papers. I want to hear it from you. There we go. The truth is, they were billionaires, Bruce. You can't amass that kind of wealth without making certain moral compromises. It's just not possible. That kind of money tempts you. My money has never corrupted me, and I'm proud of it. But you're hardly the norm. He'll grease the wheels of politics. Falcone was the master. I'm sorry if he sees fatness or whatever. I'm hot. It's all hell. Your father, Hamilton Hill, and Falcone. I gotta have my shirt up. I'm, I can't take it. Nothing happened in Gotham without them knowing.
working with Falcon and Ray. I expected a regular attorney, not a pact with the devil. Your father was a good man in many ways, but this was his undoing. I want you to know I had my suitcases ready. I couldn't stand to be around your father anymore. But then they were killed, and you were all alone. And I just couldn't walk out the door. Everything I did, everything I've ever done, was out of love for you. I hope you can forgive me. How can I hold this against you? You're all I've got. Thank you. I won't let you down again. This is the first time I've been back here since that night. When the police called me to collect you, I thought they'd finally arrested your father. I couldn't believe a lowlife thug like Joe Chill would have the audacity to rob and kill Thomas Wayne. He was simply too well known, too, too big. Yes, there it was. Wouldn't Chill just run or be recognize him? That was a fair assumption. But he didn't. You always said it was a simple money. In 20 years, you never wavered from that story. I can recall every moment of that night in vivid detail. But maybe that's why. Sometimes we block out things we don't want to face. Maybe there was some detail I overlooked. Okay. I don't know how things wouldn't wouldn't have changed in twenty years, but whatever. I want you standing here. Right now. And what would the Batman do with his own parents killer? The possibilities of frightening. I don't want to ask him one question. Why? My parents could have given him anything. Why would he just shoot them? He was stabbed to death in prison. No one mourns for Joe Chill, Bruce. Well, damn. Hey, he got what he deserved then. Fucking bastard. Hope he gets stabbed in the butt by the butt stabber. <laughs> Markiplier joke there. He just wanted to protect us. He thought he was invincible. Sadly, he was mistaken. I wish they wouldn't have this white on white. Part. I can't read the shit when they, they do that. His flaws, yes. But you more than anyone should be able to appreciate that he was a complicated man. Why would he shoot? Her though, just because she's associated with him? Hmm. <coughs> I love that movie. Saw it countless times at that theater. How long did it play that? Only when you wanted to see the person. Your mother arranged the special screenings personally. I never knew that. It's always so good to be. Hmm. Well, damn, that's that's really good. Ah, oh, yes, there we go. The fans finally really good on me. Where exactly does the memory end? With my father pleading, you don't have to do this. And the gun fires. And after that. There are considerable gaps in that recollection. <laughs> Do I really want to know? something but
Even though it's a minute right Let's say move, and then I was fucking using the left stick, and it wasn't moving. I don't know. And that's the beginning of the Batman episode two. Broken, broken memories. Yeah, I will delete you all. Sorry. If you don't, if you didn't watch TNA uh, a couple years back or watch WWE, you won't get that joke. That's Matt Hardy's new gimmick. Well, it's been it's like three or four years old, but still. That's a gimmick he's been doing, so. Getting you in to see Falcone like this? I don't have to tell you how many rules we're breaking. Now, don't get me wrong, I'm always here for you. This could land us both in hot water. I pull all the strings I have with the lieutenant. They're not come back to bite us. That means a lot to me. I know it does, Bruce. It doesn't make it any easier. Last time we brushed shoulders with Falcone, the press made us pay. At least tell me what this is about. Look, I'm all for blind support, but I should at least know what I'm getting myself into. I'm not sure, but I think Falcone put a hit on my parents. Wait, what? Bruce, that's... that's terrible. That's why I have to speak with him. I have to know for sure. Bruce, I appreciate you opening up to me, but just try and keep it cool in there. I don't want any headlines taking away from my debate with Hill. Gentlemen, we finally put Falcone in his cage. Now, thanks to the information you gave me, Bruce, we'll never get out. Oh, I'm sorry, but information? What information? Oh, I assume you knew. I was going to contact your office first thing, but everything's been a little busy. Sorry, Harvey, I was going to tell you. Well, tell me what? Your friend here gave us a case that'll put Balcony away for life. A catalog of his entire criminal empire. Is that a fact? It's the reason I said yes to this unorthodox request. Hmm. So what if I would have gave it to the reporter? Yeah, right? bring it in. It'd probably been a lot harder to get in here. Better not get off again. He's not getting off that one. Not this time. Am I not even get in here? I just wanted to say, some of us police support you, despite what the media is saying. Thanks, Sergeant. Ain't you the bitch that keeps shooting at me? Keeping 
Falcone in the infirmary. Lucky he didn't get roughed up more. I can tell Batman wanted to kill him. He held back. He cares about doing the right thing. Whoever he is behind him is. Batman's a hero here. Now, it's great to know he's out there watching over the city. Uh, that's another thing. I could have killed him. If I would have right, killed him, then I would have get no answers. Say what you gotta say. And Batman yeah. would be branded, definitely branded a criminal. Well, eh. it's not. It's not ever right. Right, episode two. Never right to kill. In a video game, it's fine. It's a video game. You can do whatever the hell you want. But children of Arkham. But, you know, Batman would be even more fucked up if I had killed him. And I'd get no answers. Or, at least not until later, anyway. Good thing I'll be out of here in a week. Just like every other time they tried to put me away. We need to talk, Falcon. You weren't so eager the last time we met. Then. I knew you'd come around, especially after the press got their teeth in you. Yeah, that was probably your fault. You're your father's son. Speaking That's of right. my father... Tommy and I were close. Tommy. More than friends. More like cousins. <laughs> Going back decades. I could avenge my father's death right now. That's not a damn thing. Friends, Tommy. Ah, so that's what this is really about. Eh? The pop picking up a 20 year old kill two killings, and they would never forget. You and me, we're practically family. I huh. should have figured that out by right now. Family, then why'd you I kill my parents? You, you showed me the door. I got a whole closet full of birthday presents I was never able to give you. Watch it, Falcone. I still see some unbroken bones. <laughs> Tough guy, yet. I bet you can to kick some answers out of me, huh? I would. Oh, father, Hill, and me, we ran this city. Still do. <clears throat> you gotta tear this brain. Can't think through it. Morphine's on the side there. Be a good boy, huh? That one could cut mine out, huh? Motherfucker. I should hurt you more, but... Forty years I keep my veins clean of any of that gunk. Oh, shit! Now, 
waiting for you in hell. You bitch! The bastard had to die. I'm not saying he didn't. I was trying to get answers, you bitch! It's the air! Stand down! Get a doctor! Secure this floor! No one can stay her out! Go! Go! Damn it! Oh, kick that bitch's ass! I was trying to get answers! It's not only you took that away from me, but scared the shit out of me, too! It does make sense, actually. We saw a glimpse of this already. Justice for a thousand unnamed victims. Now it is a PR disaster. How can we this corruption when our own cops are redecorating the precinct with their prisoners' brains? Listen, we gotta get out in front of this. We gotta spin it as best we can. Issue a statement saying we have a shooter in custody. The details are still coming. We're investigating the usual. Slow down, Harvey. We need the facts first. A simple fact. She walked in and shot him. Then we need the complex facts. Like how and why. Lieutenant, uh, District, District Attorney, that's uh, Cal County's lawyer is here. Lovely. I could delay them for a little while. We still need answers. Tell me if she says anything. I have to know why she did this. <sighs> Alfred, Falcone's been murdered. Good God! I'm looking into it, but I'll need access to the back of here for anything I find. Connection secured. Alfred, I'm gonna try and confirm some suspicions of mine. Okay, here we go. Fresh injection site. That doesn't look like blood. The veins still visible beneath their skin. Alfred, I think I found the substance. Analyze and forward me the result. This awful feeling something terrible happened. Uh, everything is such a blur. It's not good, Sergeant. You shot Falcone. I did what? No. Yeah, it's true. I believe you were drugged, Sergeant. I... It would explain a lot. Listen, you have to believe me. I talk big about hurting dogs like Falcone, but I would never, never betray the lieutenant. So, why? I remember a sharp pain. It was an injection site on your neck. Then it just felt light, like I could do whatever I wanted. No guilt, no consequence. There was a voice in my ear insisting Falcone was going to get off. And all I knew was that I had to stop that. 
I have to. No matter what. That's why I should have. They were a million miles away. Like you were hypnotized? Uh, under some mind control? Not mind control. More like my interest control is gone. My anger was the only thing that mattered. I remember a hand on my arm. Guiding me. Like a parent with a child. The voice. It was saying something about revolution. Revolution? Come on, say something somewhere. Yeah, he did, didn't he? I'm so sorry, Lieutenant. I let you down. We stole from Tony's lawyers for now, but they'll be back. How is she? Did she tell you anything? Hey, don't worry about it. No evidence that she was drugged. A fresh injection site on her neck. I was out of my mind, Lieutenant. Please believe me. Hey, I do. Of course I do. Hey. Get forensics in here. Now! She remembers a voice saying something about revolution. That's not much to go on. Now, if you're bringing forensics in, let's get Bruce out. Why? I gotta get back to the main. Gotta leave none of the others behind us. Bruce! What? what are you doing here? My friends in the, in the GCPD have been telling stories some kind of lockdown? I'm, I'm sorry, Vicky. I, I don't have time. Don't brush me off. Word is there were shots fired near where Falcone was being held. Know anything about that? I mean, he must have been back there when it happened. Where did you get that? So it's true? No, I didn't say that. Word is you turned over enough dirt on Falcone to put him in Blackgate prison for a moment. A day after he showed up at your house. Now you're here. You can't afford to be associated with another scandal. I can keep your name out of whatever we print, but you need to give me something I can use. Who fired the shot? A cop? I can tell by the way you're brushing me off that something. a little bit of a dick. I don't want that, but whatever. analyzing the chemicals from Montoya's bloodstream. Throw that up on the monitor. The residue I scan on Montoya is similar to the nerve agent I found the docks. Let's see what we got. It's ironic that Falcone died at the hands of someone drugged with his chemicals. <laughs> Who'd have guessed that how he'd meet his maker? That is hilarious. Bed, surrounded by police who were ordered to protect him. Falcone out of cover. He causes much pain as he did eventually and comes back on you. We should all be mindful of that. But I hope he told you something before he was killed. What did you learn from him? Practically family, he said. Family? Tony, I don't recall any Sunday dinners with the mob. It wasn't Falcone who called it it. Yeah, well, I suppose that makes sense. Your father, Hill, and Falcone would have balanced each other out. Computers pinpointed reference points on the two compounds. The men at the docks were doused with the base chemicals. The reaction was messy, out of control. It 
price for fine blood is like a weapon. It only took a small injection to strip Montoya of her moral filters and make her act on her base impulses. Both compounds seem stable, but they're quick to fall apart. Whoever processed it knew what they were doing. What could the creators of this drug possibly have in mind? Fighting your wars is one thing, but dragging others to fight them for you... Oh. They can so make an army. They can build a small army of remorseless assassins. The thought is chilling. Yes. Your drones are in position to triangulate Cobblepot's location. Had a feeling. So my friend said that uh, um, Bane was in this episode, and Joker apparently is not in the game, which disappointment. But eh, oh, it's Oswald. The Skyline Club. Jesus, didn't even wait for Falcone's body to get cold, did you, Oz? Mm -hmm. Going to speak with him, Bruce. Bruce Wayne already tried to talk to him. It's time to get the back. All right. Finally, put on the suit. Oh. Yeah, and it's amazing how the Game of Thrones game. It, I would say, it ended. Probably ended about. Late 2015, I don't even know when it was released. But it ended late 2015 or somewhere in 2016. That would leave two years, two and a half years, for another to bring out another episode or another season. But they haven't. And meanwhile, this just came out not that long ago and they're already bringing out a second season. Why not another Game of Thrones? Whatever. I don't know how often the Game of Thrones comes on, but usually it's like every season. Or every new year. Like for The Walking Dead, it comes out October, and then it comes back out on October again. For another season. I need to stop talking over this shit, but I gotta say what I wanna say, otherwise I'm not gonna remember it. Damn, they're already, uh, taking over his, uh, compound. Come here, bitch. Ha! You not. Go take out his own. If only it was this easy to, uh... If only it was this easy to get in here in the first place. Let him go. Batman! It's about time! You kill a crime boss, you'd expect a word of thanks from Gotham's number one vigilante. Oh, don't worry, I'll pass away to Gotham's nose and make it happen. They'll be pleased to know you've been so highly of their work. 
I said let him go. You hear that, Rolly? That sounded like an order. I'll crush him. Now, now, have a little respect for the bat. Think he underestimates him. Is this about Falcone? We all saw how you felt about Falcone. Pounded him into a pound on live TV. Oh, yeah. If you were truly the defender of this city, you'd have finished the job yourself. Falcone deserved to die. Falcone had it coming, but that doesn't mean you're off the hook. There we go! That wasn't so hard to admit, was it? No. It must be a relief to get that stick out of your arse every now and then. As a show of good faith, I'm gonna let this one go. And then it's How's about we talk this way? Oh, yeah. We'll deal with that kind of thing. Now, if we could just cut out the rest of the rot. Wait, like that's still sitting there? Ordinary folks might be able to breathe. Oswald Cobblepot. What is it about this place that attracts criminal scum like you? Got it! Me! You got flat! Here's the thing. I actually admire you about that. We both want the same kinds of things. Me and my people, we've got big plans for Gotham. They found Catwoman. What do you want with her? We had a deal, she didn't make good on it. So, sorry this didn't work out, mate. I'd stay with us. I would, but I still got a Catwoman problem to deal with. Or, what's her name again? Selena. Yes! Oh, beautiful night! <laughs> <laughs> Don't make me whoop your ass! Oh, I fucked up. Oh! And here I was just thinking I haven't been killed yet. But in every game, I must get killed. At least once. Or a dozen times. It has to happen. <laughs> I fucked up again, but I got it this time. Oh, there we go. I fucked up again. Okay. When you, you can push the wrong button, you can still push the right button, so that's good. It doesn't completely fuck you by doing that, because sometimes it would do that. Oh! Well, I figured that was happening. Okay, Braun Strowman. Oh, God! Uh, uh, Batman? Wrigley Bat? I pressed X and it... Okay. I pressed X and it let me do it anyway. Hey. Bitch is gone. Wow. Open sesame. Why do you just go back out the window? Alfred, track down Selena Kyle. I'll find her right away. Rubron Strowman, he's fast as a daisy. What? Daisy. I'm your number one fan! Good work, Oleg. Oh, God. It's from Saints Row 4. Right at the beginning. <laughs> I can't read that. Ugh. Uh. I'll get this for PS4 or 5, whenever the hell that comes out. If it's on there. And I'll play it. I'll play all of these again because my TV's shit and the phone doesn't really capture it that much either. So, I will play it again um, in the future. Or if I get a PC, I'll do that. I don't know. It will be played again. All of them will be played again. The stacked deck. Ugh. Okay. Uh, no.
now I'm digging my pot, so. Can you move the fuck out of my way? This tends to shitty music. Tunes for drinking, dancing, and fighting. Not necessarily in that order. Not necessarily in that order. Like you walked into the wrong bar. You know Slay and Kyle, they're men after her. Uh-huh. When are they? No. Well, these ones are trying to kill her. Hey. I mean they Don't are after her. It's easy. Do you? Do it. Cops take all your fancy clothes. Are mm -hmm. you trying to lay low? Of course, you're not really the low lying type. Nice to meet you. Anyway. Frank. Yeah. Funny seeing you here. So much in the papers. Whole other thing, meeting the man in real life. Yeah, shorter than I thought you would be. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. He didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. So, I need to tell you something important. About a bad apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. Well, I've met a couple of his goons myself. Your client is a one for subtlety. The man who hired you, his name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. <laughs> That I know. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw me. The penguin. <laughs> I'm going to deal with it. Wait, is it a penguin? But I need you to tell me everything you know about it. That's not a penguin. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Cool Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics? You two have a lot in common. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. Why leave that? Oswald wanted Falcone out of the picture. Looks like he succeeded. So what? He wants to take his place? Maybe. For starters. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald. Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. I need you, Selena. Not right. If Penguin is as deadly as you say, I need all the help I can get. Bruce, sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. You and Harvey, it's pretty clear you aren't just friends. Please. I'm just toying with him. Why don't you take my claws out for someone special? Oh. You know what I mean. And there they are. And of course, it's gonna slow down. Well, at least no dialogue's happening, so. Alright, what? Fuck, Negan! Well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle, Penguin says hello. Hello. I just realized the two bucks stuff. Beat it. We're here for her. Nah, I don't think so, bitch. 
You care about your own skin? You'll get the hell out! She's with me. I think you need to leave. I didn't get to see what happened. Oh, because I fucked it up. Uh, all I did was get a tiny stab. The first episode, I got shot. I mean, yeah, I was wearing the body armor, but I still got shot. And besides, I mean... I'm still the fucking Batman. Still shit the guys who fucked up. So of course he doesn't get up and fuck me now. Or attack me. Ah, it doesn't look right. Come on, this way. Hey, you know what? She sounds like um I can't I can't remember her name. But the other bitch from Tales from the Borderlands. Bruce sounds like Reese, and uh, she sounds like uh, the second character you play as. That's cool. Quick, take the alleyway. Oh, good. <laughs> Negative. Let's check the other side. More ones. Plenty of places to hide, and you're gonna get a check. <sighs> Oh. I like that touch better than the other touch. K Fuck it. Let's kiss her ass. Uh. Let's get out of here. You really are a fucking tease. <laughs> take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Yes or no, will you help me stop Penguin? I'm gonna say maybe, but only because he's trying to kill me. Oh, you guys are trying to kill me. Say yes. Of 
course it would be. Yeah, I shouldn't. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of the smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. If the back computer found anything, yes. Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? The last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on way. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. What else is on there? Looks like they're in contact many times. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but... If I may offer a word of advice. People look up to Batman after how you handled Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce oh. would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Okay. See, I was just thinking about this, and I'm glad they gave me this decision here. I was wanting to play as Batman, but uh, Alfred is right. Me terrorizing the uh, mayor could make me um, look more of a bad guy than I really want to. So... I, uh... I'm gonna go as Bruce. Did you say going as Bruce isn't the smart choice? I don't know. Well, whatever. 52... 53 minutes... And 80%. Yeah, we'll keep going. Shit, it's only 80%. I'm gonna do this whole episode. I'm, I'm hyped. Well, oh, damn. Sorry, the mayor's busy. Do you have an appointment? Uh, the mayor's doing debate prep. He really can't be disturbed right now. No, so you better tell him I'm coming. Uh, sir? Bruce Wayne? To see you? He'll be right out. I'm not waiting. I'm not going to wait. Bruce Wayne? Finally, you've come to see me. Of course, only after your name's been dragged through the mud. Don't get me wrong. I'm glad to see you. But you're a day late and a great many dollars short. This isn't a social call, Phil. I'm here for answers. Well, well, straight to business. And I was going to have Deborah make you a martini. Your father and I, we took this city and made it ours. Uh, he Our better suits the penguin. We built everything we have. You were born with it. Up. A soft boy like you wouldn't understand what it takes in a rise to the top. Oh, I understand. Very well. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Sounds like it. It is you. People so, do impressions. What's your point? I take it you have one. Or are you just fond of my dulcet tokens? Why attack me? Because of Dent and the campaign? I'm in Kalpot's crosshairs, same as you. But you fed them dirt on me. Only the files I seized from Wayne Manor. Your father felt Kone and I, he had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Oswald's family signed it over to us, along with the rest of their assets. If that's true, then Oswald has a right to be. Is there any proof? 
Your father and I hid our traps quite well. There's so much more I could share, if only we were friends. I could help you deal with Penguin, put you in on some family history. But I'm caught in a dogfight. Oh! Career, and my rival is part of this part. So... Now, that right? I either betray Harvey or help or this fucker get elected. I'm not gonna do that. A lot more resources for helping a new friend. Fuck not that. A chance, though. I'm not cutting Harvey loose. You dropped on your head. When the mayor of Gotham extends a hand, you take it. I'm fucking Bruce I'm Wayne. Your hand, not with your voice on tape. You forget who you're talking to. You know who you're talking to. Says, I never left such and such a message. And all the judges bow their heads and say, Yes, sir. I'm the man who sends the police to your house to take your things. And I give them to whoever I please. You're nothing like your father. You'd never have the backbone to do what we did. I'm the heavyweight, Wayne. And you're punching above your weight. Get out of the ring before you get hurt. I know exactly who I'm talking to. I'm the man who drove you over this rail without a second thought in my words and this whole thing disappeared before you hit the ground. <laughs> if that voicemail makes it to the papers, or anywhere else I don't like, I'll turn my commissioner loose on your lieutenant for that fiasco down at the precinct. Gordon? And then I'll turn him on you and Dent for being there. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a debate to prep for. Did I mess up? Get him out of here. You know Harvey is going to embarrass you. Dent's campaign is on his last legs. Tonight, it hits the canvas. It's you who's going downhill, and you're not getting back up. Bye, you fat bitch! Alfred, get a warning to Gordon. Tell him to increase security at the debate. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. trophies because I want to see if I uh, if there's anything special that I could get on these games like I know for the most part like The Walking Dead um, you unlock all the trophies normally but like maybe there's a special thing on here and normally I'm not a trophy hunter but in games like this it would be much easier to do I wonder what else is then to get every trophy in like Call of Duty or whatever As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has triple security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The Obviously. auditorium where the debate's being held. Mm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hills, details about your father it must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how he must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To hear their crimes detailed, first by Falcone, then by a snake like Hill. It makes me question myself. You shouldn't, Bruce. You are your own man. And the city needs you now more than ever. Uh. I'll uh, leave you to it then. Okay. Yeah. Wait a minute. 
images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at what they want us to see. Warn Gord that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. <laughs> Listen to me. Your life is in danger. Because of Penguin and his thugs? Thanks, but there is an army of security here. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. Well, oh. kill the no, me. what the fuck? <laughs> it's not overkill, Harvey. It's a real... Please. I need to get this off my chest. Uh, look. Bruce. I didn't want to do this over the phone, but... My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Until all this mess with your family blows over. They're afraid it's not a very good optic. Ouch, Harley. How about a sucker punch? What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Balcony, you're a liability. I'm trying to get but here and see... here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money, I am dead in the water. Yes. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public, but you and me, we all know the truth about our friendship. No matter what we need a new mayor, Hill needs to be removed. I knew you'd see it that way. Listen, I hate to push you, but I, I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Whatever it takes to save Gotham, that's what we wanted. I'll always support you, Ozzy. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> Guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. Uh, no matter what I have to say tonight, remember. You are always my friend. Harvey! Damn it, Harvey! Ah! Harvey's gonna die! So far, no bang, so I don't know if he just been retarded and didn't remember. Because he already watched other people play this, so he already knows what happened in this game. Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. I'm glad I took a chance on this, this collaboration of ours. Keep on doing what you're doing, and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do. A hero. The enemies we're facing, the things all have to do, Gotham might not want to see. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. <laughs> oh, Catwoman, what the fuck? I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? We're all on the same side, Jim. Well, it's better not come back to bite me. You Tell keep saying that. Come in. That, um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. 
Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, if you scratch my back, I cut some people off. This is no bar fight. They're coming with everything they have. Good. That brawl barely had me break a sweat. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha, do you read? Now aren't you glad I'm here? A little bit, yeah. <laughs> Does work for me. Uh, I'll give a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. <laughs> we are seriously underfunded at GCPD. Sounds like a vote for dead lieutenant. <laughs> <laughs> What? I just realized, technically Batman and Bruce Wayne are two different people, so <laughs> imagine if Batman just walked in to the debate or the voting shit, and he votes for <laughs> one vote from that man. <laughs> That'd be funny. This is where is this dude going? They always gotta go outside, away from everybody else. Makes it easier on them, man. Recorded. Oh, okay. Huh? What? What's going on? I love how easy it is to take out the goons. It's like not even a problem. Obviously. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. God damn it. Oh, God. Who the, the fuck? Gagrim. I know who the fuck. Oh, oh, I hate to be a down with these hostages. I don't like their chances. Casualties are inevitable. It's only a question of how many. Inspiring. You really know how to pep a girl up. Sorry. Oh, it's Braun Strowman again. These guys are armed to the teeth. I told you they're gonna bring everything they got. Please, no. Go on then. Introduce the candidates. Stage right, huh? All right, I'll get you started. But this is your show. Three hostiles. Gonna take them out quietly. Obviously. Alright, so... Alright, so... How's this guy getting taken out? Ooh, there's so many ways. Have her take him out. How'd that work? I don't know if that would do any like serious damage or something. I like destruction, so. Even though it doesn't show it, I'm sure we have a. That looks good. I'm sure we have a uh, time limit here. Catwoman.
I'll use Catwoman for the last one. Well, maybe that would be good. Uh, depending on how these work. Uh, that one's lame. Okay. Uh, door and plug. Looks good. Light. Her again. Wait, what's up here? Hang his ass? What's in his ass flying? Yes! That's exactly how I want. Okay. Oh, yes! Yes! That was awesome! I'm so glad I did that. <laughs> Bitch! Yes! That was awesome, too! What? This motherfucker's still moving. Wait, there's still one more dude I haven't taken care of. Maybe next time. I didn't even take care of the third guy. Keep your heads down. Make for the police line. Look, that guy's just standing there. I know a bird from our I think the game broke because there's still a soldier over there. This is spiraling out of control. They have no idea about the man behind the mask. Whoever it is, they're smart. Let someone else get their hands dirty. Go on, Doc. You know what to do. I still don't understand why we didn't take out that third guard. We had three options. I set it all up, and we didn't even get to see him thrown into the door. Trying. Roll that cake! Subject 
your father was dead. Subject 9, Esther Cobblepot. You've been declared criminally insane. And committed to Arkham indefinitely as a reward of the state. Please, I'll sell you for that. Please don't do this. You had your chance. You should have made the kill off for you. Different the cog. You will want it, Esther. You know I always get what I want. Come into the procedure. Give her a dose she won't come back from. Now or no. Now or see. So I'm gonna beat your ass. Shoot him! You come through the door, don't just stand there looking at him. Shoot his ass! Well, shit's hit the fan now, so. Still recording. Yes, yes I do. Oh, nice. Fuck you, Wazzy. Why don't you take a care of Oh, hello, Strowman. You fucker! No! No! Oh! Oh! Bitch! I took out Thomas Wade. That 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 was all him. He didn't know when to stop. I have him killed because of it. You fucker! So this is for her. Don't kill anyone else! What are you saying? You dead? Well, at least you won't have to be worried about being, uh... Eat it, motherfucker! Eat it! Where's your mate? Who's Wayne? Your biggest supporter? And he didn't even turn up! Harvey, you suck at a fight, man! Batman! The revolution's already started! It's too late to join! Your revolution is over, Penguin. On the contrary, we're just getting started! Oh shit! No! Now I gotta choose between Harvey and Selena. Ah! Oh. Oh. Damn it! Ah! Oh. Damn you, Telltale! I don't want either of them to die. Ah! Oh. Bloody hell!
thank you though. Stuff up. Now she's gonna be pissed off at me because I basically brought her into this and I almost got her killed. After Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. Well, several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. I think that's about wraps it up there. Well, that was interesting. Well, that was Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Mr. Wayne. What's that? But there still will be scars. See? Ah. Did you see her? At least Selena got away. There. Oh, maybe. Come on. She kind of got both. Come on, you can keep going, girl. Lawyers representing Bruce Wayne have no comment. She's gonna hold it against time. me, but I had to save Harvey. And besides that, she said she owed me, so she came of her own accord. And we have opened your eyes. Well. And that was episode two, The Children of Arkham. Did you ease Fatone, Fatone pain or make him suffer? I should make him suffer. 70% of people decided to do that. Nice of them. Did you kiss Selena? 70% of people tried to do that. Well, damn. Did you visit Mayor Hill as Bruce or Batman? 57 did, uh, 50 percent people, or 50 percent did go as Bruce. Did you withdraw your funding for Harvey's campaign? 80 percent of players gave, said that I'll keep funding you. Holy hell! And did you save Selena or Harvey? Wow. Um. 30% of players went for uh, Harvey. Majority of people went for Selena. I'm, uh, that's amazing, actually. Um, well, damn. I kind of like that um, side by side. You know, you get the credits on one side and your choices on the other. That's kind of cool. I'm on Batman, the Telltale series. Alright, and I didn't get to see Bane, unless that dude is Bane. Batman saved me. I know this isn't over. <laughs> Authorities are still Ew. rambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy, but there's still no sign of the last leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is, who's next? Harvey would have been the next one. After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham. Sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now they want to decide what your future of this company will be. Do you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting?
Adventures, rare comics, or books are sold. Alright, well. That was a pretty fantastic episode. So, if you enjoyed, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, become phenomenal. As always, stay phenomenal. Peace, Maddox!